And when's this thing supposed to start? Uh, ten minutes, I think. You think? Uh, this is a nightmare. Why did I ever agree to do this? Chamber of Commerce owes me big for this. Jeez. I hear ya. I love that cat guy. Yeah. What? Okay, so here's the thing. You won't have many lines. What? I've had, like, three no-shows. Why? This is a poetry, like, uh, a play, rather. Because this whole thing is stupid and nobody cares about it. B. Please. It's a fun part. B. Yeah. I will totally save your ass. Uh. I might have memorized from when I was a kid. I might have this memorized, excuse me. Probably not. They they rewrote it like six times in the past two years to be spookier. So it's like 20% actual history now and like 80% spooks. So it's like fake history now? It's like the bad remake that doesn't respect the source material. It starts off normal but gets... Eh, anyway, you got like five minutes to look at your lines. I can wig it. May, please don't wing it. Okay. <laughs> ah, the old pickaxe presents. Mm -hmm. What's their store again? It's a uh, tool store. Right. I like, you know, catch all. And oh, I didn't see you there. I thought it was a tool store. I'm like, why would they be putting out a play? But it doesn't matter. I like the. Because like it's the only store that's not closed anymore. Yeah. You got the Daniel Boone hats. Be ye ghosts. Are be ye here to hear the tale of how Possum <laughs> Springs came to be? Oh, God, small town reenactment. Yes. I just realized. <laughs> Through the mists of time, I see wary fur trappers from 1793. <laughs> Brother John. Oh, God. Yes, Brother Stephen. From this vantage point, I do spy a deep hollow and within a great dead tree. And besides with, uh, which, a spring. Blessed are we, Brother Stephen, for truly my throat is parched from these long and arduous travels and carrying these 300 beaver pelts. Let us make haste, O oh, excellent brother. Okay, so it's what line you think actually is 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 in there. What what best fits? Right. Okay. Ho, oh, travelers, spare a crust of bread for a needy woman. And that that little tone means I think that means you got it right. It, it, go, it gets a little haggard, witch. <laughs> Horrible to look upon. Cruel young men. Ye did not even offer one of thy 300 fine beaver pelts to warm my ancient bones. <laughs> I shall curse ye in thee, and this, shall, this very night ye shall perish. I am fearful. Steady, Brother Stephen. I did not venture out into these hills to joust words with a hell hag. <laughs> I was born among these trees neath a harvest moon, and ye shall die under that moon. Brother John, I am frightened. Faith, Brother Stephen, art thou so easily shaken by the ramblings of an old crone? <laughs> Come, help me carry these 300 beaver pelts. But little did anyone know that the witch did not curse in vain. <laughs> Thank this you. Sad applause. For attending the filming of Wishbone. Act and two. now, back to Wishbone. <laughs> help! Help! Who will help a poor traveler? Oh, God. Uh, um... Oh, by the moon and stars above us, sir, I beseech thee, what is thy trouble? 
you're, you're in this? <laughs> yep. Ag witch. Yep. <laughs> I, I swear the friend that this very day, this horrifying crone did curse my brother and I to die. Zwounds. We can't buy this very spring beneath the dead tree. And even now his body lieth upon the earth. Lifeless as a pile of 300 <laughs> beaver pelts. Oh, it chilleth the heart. Uh, a curse upon rude young men. That's not... Um, uh, she has cursed the spring, and now I shall die. I also... <laughs> I also picked what you picked there. Wow. So it was a little, a little wrong, but I think it doesn't matter. I am also undone, for I have dranketh of the water. Don't leave me here, Greg. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> and yet, even there, the curses lust for blood uh, would not be sated. Twitch. Yeah, a little twitchy. Oh, small town life sucks. I could never do it. It has its charms, I'm sure, but this is not one of them. I don't know how Liam did it. Yeah. Gaze upon them. Gaze upon these spirits. Brother, we are now ghosts. Ah! <laughs> I am tormented by the accusing glare of 300 ghostly beavers. It's pretty strong. It would seem that all who die here are cursed to never leave. Doth that witch know what she hath done? Well, they're just on the counter. Yeah. I did not. I did not. <laughs> I guess. Uh. Mm, crap. <laughs> For. <laughs> For each man is determined on his path, and each path leads only to his end. Okay. And yet each path may lead to places unknown. Oh, 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 wait, hold on. <laughs> you. From the bus station. <laughs> Young witch. It is I, the god of the forest. Uh, just didn't expect you to. Ain't that the way. So... Which thou hast tarried too long in this world, I banish thee to wander in the night through the stranger places. <laughs> uh, I, I... What? Young witch, let me speak wisdom to you. We begin and we end at night in the woods. But that is not the whole of the story. Title drop. Mm. Mm. This is your line. Forest God, thou hast no power here. Even now, thy end beginneth. Ah, my infernal powers. Shh, young witch. Even now, the world you know endeth, and who can say what lieth in the world to come? Wow. Beware as you go, for there are ghosts. Ooh. <laughs> Take care. store. And so was founded then this festival. On Halloween we shall celebrate the dying of the year and the founding of Possum Springs. I, Mary Ghost, <laughs> decree it! Ah, uh, the beaver population suffered a decline and now our biggest exports are corn and pumpkins. We used to be the county seat. Uh, yeah. 
actually the myth of the Wicked Witch is the product of centuries of persecution by... And that's our show. <laughs> Be careful as you leave here. For who knows what may lurk in the darkness. So also be sure to pick up a flyer on your way out. Her guys got big. Yeah. No, I think they're half. Yeah. I don't know. From the Possum Springs Chamber of Commerce. Support your spooky local businesses. Like there might be six people in the room right. watching this. Perfectly pathetic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It can't be too popular, but it can't be super pathetic. It can't be empty. Like the same number of people as the performers, basically. Exactly, exactly. That was fun, actually. Which is not unlike that one night where, on Halloween, the church decided to have a bring your kids to church for not Halloween. I do remember you talking about (laughs) this, and I should have fucking connected the thoughts. It was pretty not great. Jeez, thanks, guys. I am never doing that again. So what are we doing now? While I'm going home, Angus McDinner, we're going to watch horror movies. Can I come? It's more of a date thing. Oh. What are you doing, B? B? B, I'm safe. B, I knew it. Queen, it B. Chamber of Commerce folks are going to the buffet out by Ham Panther. Kind of have to go business stuff. Hate this. But you're good at it. Both of those things can be true. Can I come? Nope. Okay. Oh. Uh, Good night. Night. <gasps> they crossed. Indecision. This is garbage. <laughs> Who that? Oh, come on. The. F- Oh my god! Hey! Anyone? Shit. I still can't jump. Uh, we do this now. We never. <laughs> Where the hell did he go? Shit. We never quite figured out where that arm came from. Mm hmm. Kind of tall. Yeah, a little bit there. That's a bear. Bear like person. May. Go home. There's a guy up there on the hill. He stole some kid. He looked like a ghost. A ghost, huh? Something like that. May, you shouldn't be out here. Doing whatever it is you're doing. No, no, no one should be out here. But there's this guy. I'll drive you home, May. No! May, now. Well, that was awfully, awfully convenient timing. Hmm. Anti-cop. Okay. So so now we're really entering, like, once it gets to this part, we start, okay. mo- we start moving fast with what the fuck is actually going down in Boston Springs. There's a couple questions floating in my head. <laughs> One of them, if I were to grab it, is what the fuck's going on? Yeah, that's, that's, that's the thing to ask. That was a weird dream. What was it? Some mysterious figure grabbed someone. That wasn't a dream. It was a motherfucker. Super serious. And then, and then, um... And Mall Cop told yeah, you to and fuck off. Yeah, and Mall Cop showed up and acted like a huge d-hole. So that was annoying. 
kind of forgot what D-hole meant for a second. I mean, it could be douche hole. It could. That's a weird hole. I know. Usually you expect dick hole, but, you know. And Willie's innovating. Yep. The innovator of violence. <laughs> um... Good. Sounds a little low. Sounds, Guess what? Sounds this a little, always sounds a little low. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a little bit of a quiet game. It doesn't like to overstay. It does it's, not. It, it's not. It doesn't scream in your face. It doesn't like to overstay. It's welcome. It doesn't like to Except yell too loudly. Greg. No. Let's try to check with Greg. Let's see what you're up to. Hey, dude. Sorry I can't hang last night. Angus says he's sorry, too. Band practice, too. Todd, yeah. Because <laughs> nice. I'm in charge and I say so. Nicely done. <laughs> Off to work, bye. Hey, May, thanks so much for your help last night. Woke up and realized I completely imposed in a big way. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I'll be at work. Clean up after last night if you want to say hello. Ah, uh, yes. It was the play. It was the play that you loved. That's what we did last time. Okay. Yeah. Hi. Very nice. It's been a minute. All right. Yeah, it feels like it's been a while. It's been a minute. So Even though it hasn't. Things like forgetting it's about about uh, May's dad's alcoholism is totally a viable thing when it's a it's couple true. sessions ago. And also, since she doesn't really write down what actually happens mm. in her journal, it's hard to know, you know? Mm. It's like, look back, you see all these scribbles, you're like, oh, okay, thanks for the update, May. No, nothing new in here. I, I Again, I don't know if that tooth... No idea what happens. Like I, I got it in my my playthrough of this when I streamed it, but like I, I don't think I ever found a use for it. Always suspicious of like one use rooms in, in like the house location. Yeah. Oh. Hey Han. Yeah, when Willie yeah. has a has a as a one use room, his eyes move suspiciously from corner I don't to corner. Trust it. Why don't you come say hello, honey bun? At some point in the game later on, you're gonna have to go down there and see what's going on. What's in the basement, Aaron? I mean May. And I some, mean attic. I mean someone and something might be there. So we because we were left on bad terms with cat mom. Yeah, that was a big old shouting match. <laughs> The old teeny shouting match. The problem match. with May is that she didn't know what she was messing with. Hey, hon. Hey, mom. You look really tired. So do you. Fuck you. Well, <laughs> I also have a splitting headache. Fair enough. Well, the weather seems to agree with you. Gray and drizzly. I could go for that today. Who wants to go for that? Hey, hon. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about yes. Oh, I was first to apologize. She lost. Me too. She lost. Yeah, I won. <laughs> I said some stuff. Didn't really mean it. Well, whether you meant it or not, that isn't how we should communicate. I don't want us to stop talking. I just, I just don't want to repeat of a few years ago. You know the biting incident. I'm really sorry, Mom. About all of it, you know. Hey, May, you okay? I'm fine. Guess I'm just stressed. You want to talk about school yeah. now? Saw some weird stuff last night. You did. Or I think I did. Want to talk about that at least? Later. Still putting it together. Not much to put together, really. Can we talk about school? Also later. Fair enough. Let's just not talk, I guess. So what are you stressed about? The numbers game. Uh, you're grown up now. Just spill it, Mom. After your, your incident a few years back. Wait, is it I, like, I, do, you, do you know what I'm starting to think it is? I, I don't know, but... No, 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 what, no, go no ahead, not go what ahead. it actually is, go but ahead. like just my, my... I wish it was true, my theory. Remember the guy that got all burnt in... in um, <laughs> Of God be for vendetta. Yeah. Remember when he's like coming out of things? Yeah. And screaming? The men I, from room. Yeah. I hope it's like that. <laughs> the incident. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Del Didn't we use that? In, we yeah, did. we used that joke in Fun Time Adventures. I, I think. think so. As you know, we went to some debt, smoothing that over. Look, all I can say is, quite frankly, <laughs> I. My one of my main goals in life. It's not Is number to get one. That moment? No, I don't want there to ever oh. be something in my past referred to as an incident. Right. You know what I mean? Like 
the incident that happened that people were around that saw. Because you know what an incident is? Uh, yes. During like a dinner with your family, you yeah. drop some spaghetti on your lap and that's it. Uh, that's what an incident is. But when people call it the incident, that means there was only one. And we all remember that I shit. I never want that. I have, uh, I have occurrences in my life. Yeah, but sure. But I do not want there ever to be the incident. Machine High is what I call my incident. <laughs> yeah, that was way more than a family gathering. That was oh. that was a couple hundred. It was a deep. couple hundred people. Couple hundred deep. I have a news story that I'll tell you about on the podcast next week. Jeez. That's almost as embarrassing oh, okay. now as as uh, as Alicia Did it happen it, recently? Yes, it happened oh, during my trip. No. So anyway, continue. Let's go. Jeez, I'm still so sorry about that. It's in the past. Let's not go back over that shit. That sounded really sarcastic. Yeah. Okay. When it came time to get you off to school, because we needed to get you out of the country, we took advantage of a kind of mortgage to make sure you were taken care of. Okay. Well, turns out it wasn't a good deal. I bet you it's because you smashed the statue in real life. Maybe. And I just feel so stupid. They like to offer these mortgages to people who maybe don't have a lot of money and aren't used to getting offers like this. They offer these mortgages to parents whose kids do round trips on statues. Yeah. Whose kids burst out of fiery rooms because the bank took advantage of us. And now they owe the, uh, they own the house and we owe them more than it's worth. What does that mean? She's 20. Means we're not sure how long into the future we'll have the house. Holy crap, we're in trouble, huh? And I'm a huge jerk. Pretty much. It's okay though, sweetie. Don't don't you worry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I should have never done that smoking six style combo on the. On you the should statue. maybe have not have. You should have probably held back. What you reading? It's a book of unsolvable. <laughs> <laughs> Unsolvable <laughs> murders <laughs> is different <laughs> than <laughs> any other type. Boom, boom. Did they all happen? <gasps> Did they all happen? Oh, I don't know. Maybe. Sure. <laughs> Want to hear a real teaser? Absolutely. Yeah. All right. There's a man lying dead in a kitchen with a bullet wound in his head. There's a man there with him. He's got some blood on his right hand, but no gun. Ice gun and bullet. Last thing, the dead guy has a scar on the back of his head. Do you know the answer? Well, I don't know if there's one answer. It's supposed to get you thinking. Uh, about murder? Can't solve a murder without someone getting murdered. Okay, so I have a question. Yeah, what question is actually pertinent mm -hmm. to the, the thing? What kind of scar? No, that, oh, that, 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 what else is in the room? Maybe, yeah. Normal stuff, refrigerator, microwave, silverware. Knives? No, no knife wounds, though. Oh, right. Hmm. Okay, I think I got it. He's Magneto. <laughs> and he... Stitch the, the gun iron into out. the guy's head after... What you got? The guy in the room is a surgeon. He's implanted a magnet oh my in the God, dead guy's right. skull. That's why he has that scar. Then the suspect used a super magnet or something on the dead guy's forehead, which pulled the magnet through the dude's head. Ha ha ha, that's why, that's why he has blood on one hand. He's Magneto. There you go. Yep, and I bet the murder weapons are stuck to the fridge. they be bloody though. Holding up a pic of Aunt Dottie. <laughs> oh, bravo, sweetie. Nailed it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know if that... You make quite a pair of investigators. Kitty investigations. Could open a detective agency go. in town. Probably use one right now. Always work for crime solvers. Browski and Browski. That's a, that's a dire statement. All right, I'm going to get going. Love you, daughter detective. You too, Inspector Mom. Oh, that's a TV we, show. We don't actually know if we solved it, though. Okay. I think if you take in what type of scar the mom gives her theory, 
I think. I can't remember. I'm satisfied with my solution. Oh, it's rainy day. My solution is resolution. Are they still working on the left side, on the right side of the screen? I'm gonna put money down. That says they are. I think now that we're in Silent <gasps> Hill world, maybe, maybe not. Oh my god! I, you know what? With the incident, I think May would be a great candidate to go to Silent Holy Hill. Holy shit! I can actually leave! I'm free! I can sing! The fog wall is open! Farming. I could farm. She could not. I could stay in town long enough. If I could stay in town long enough. Yeah. No. I could see getting into the farm life. Onlyfarmers.com. Farmers only. Hey, does that mean I have to be a farmer to date farmers? No. I saw those commercials mm -hmm. the entire weekend. Mm -hmm. uh, Christian Islamic Farmer Singles Only dot com. <laughs> the problem with farms is the amount of poop. That's true. Even if you don't have animals, you can actually buy you actually buy poop or something and, and shovel it all over the place that's so real it's madness it is it's poop madness <laughs> plague i don't understand poop mania it. well you know what you don't understand it either but you were born into it so you didn't his, have to really his entire it. patreon account is to pay for the poop bags yeah like, oh. i don't yeah i saw it i don't fault you man it was the way you you know it's not the life you chose and the life didn't choose you either <laughs> It was just a shitty in between. It just was. It was a shitty compromise. Now, yeah. let me think about poop farms. I hope. I hope she is. Anything? Maybe she pressed something. Did she get down? Super gross. No, it's just. It's just sit. It's just sit and think. Yeah. <laughs> Holding down and pressing jump does not, in fact, let you jump up. No, that'd be crazy. Bridges freeze before road. Sure, whatever you say. Yeah, it's the beginning. You're not lost, you're here. Which is a great thing to say to lost people. After this, a few miles and you go onto the highway. It's just rolling fields and farms. I miss the corn mazes this fall. Did they spell... Oh, mazes. Okay, not, not maze. Maze. Not maze. No. Mazes. <clears throat> Correct way. Haunted barn of the brittle. Always next year. Campfires and corn dogs. I don't remember eating the end fucking corn dogs around the campfire. I shouldn't have went up on that inflection. Oh no! It is the end of the fog <laughs> gate. That, that, that I was about to say, the fog of war. And <laughs> well, then, now what happens is, now that I come and I see nothing, the music stops, and then I turn around, and I run back towards the entrance, and then the boss drops. Exactly, exactly. That's how you're supposed to do it. Or if there's an item on the ground, you picked it up. And then every the cutscene starts. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> But so far, no dice. You, you have to put the, the guts of the vile blood queen into the crystal. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I guess that construction was hiding nothing and nowhere. Uh, yeah, maybe. I. Mm, I, I, kinda, I mean, it'll I, become eventually as significant when the big emotional scene happens over there. But for I, now, maybe. it's just the setting. We're gonna go sit on the bridge at some point. How's it going, Selmers? How was your Halloween? Weird. W went to Harfest. Saw some messed up shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think it was real. I had a really bad nightmare. Cool. I stayed in a candy and watched TV. Halloween episodes were on. All those are the best. Well, I was out living a Halloween episode, okay? Whoa. Yep. Wanna hear a new poem, though? It always defaults to no. Autumn wins. Autumn sins. Okay. Autumn times. Autumn crimes. What's considered an autumn crime? Robbing a gas station and blowing it up in November. <laughs> yeah, okay, no, that, that makes sense. I believe that. Uh, hey, Mr. Chazakov. Yes, Silma. You're gonna break your neck someday. I will make sure to fall right on top of you. <laughs> I'm big enough target. <laughs> I'm bigger than you. You'll be splattered. You too. <laughs> leaves, leaves, leaves. Is that a poem? No. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> that moment where you're waiting for the dialogue to continue and it doesn't, it almost yeah. feels deliberate. It almost feels it. The Mrs. Vanish this porch herself, varnished. Don't go track mud all over it. Okay, well, you know what? I'm a, I'm a fucking take a bat. 
to your porch. How about that? Do you have a job, sir? Sir? No, no, that's one of those guys on Disability Forever. You know how that works. Oh, matters. okay, yeah. No, I can see that. And then they just kind of hang around and... And tell people to the not, not fucking put mud don't, on their no, porch. No, don't track on the porch. In autumn. Yeah, you know how it'd be. Oh, really? I, I, I always stayed away from everyone's, like, everyone else in my neighbor's lawns and shit. Never. Well, okay, that's that's a, actually a huge lie. I went all the time in people's backyards as super soakers and, like, pretended to be cool. Didn't really work. Mm. Didn't take, but... I don't like Yeah, you're trying to get up there. Yeah. But, uh, no, the only reason to, like, you know, go up on other people's porches and shit back in the day was to get their mangoes and... People would do that to our mangoes, and <laughs> it was a whole thing. It was a whole mango thing. It'd be funny if it got a little more serious. There, like the only other reason to pour is, you know, to get up there and people's pour and get high. <laughs> I'm like, what? Yeah, <laughs> not in Grenada. <laughs> oh, you had to have your wits about you at all times. I mean, look, the the, the, the experience of being there was sobering enough as it is. <laughs> It's like I can't, I can't lose focus any second. You need to, you need to be wary of that which may come for you. <laughs> which is, which is many a thing. And losing, losing control of your senses is the biggest mistake. Of all.